Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review this full season one on Hulu. And this is a comedy series created by and starring Chris Estrada, who brings his brand of comedy and his approach to things to this series, playing Julio Lopez, who is a, as described in the synopsis, a punk-ass bitch. Uh, with a heart of gold who goes out of his way to help everyone but himself. And this series focuses on Julio and his pals trying to do all kinds of stuff, you know, trying to make ends meet, trying to help each other, and getting into the weirdest shenanigans. Like, moving a giant freezer or something down a giant hill, trying to avoid destroying an ice cream truck. Um, Fred Armisen showing up and having one very strange series of interactions and contests with them to uh, prove some really messed up rich people stuff. And everything in between, and I feel like this series balances the humor, which this is a very funny series, with different themes and ideas from like racial relations, like dealing with... Uh, Latinx people and black people and their dynamics and their differences and how they interact with things in different ways to family dynamics and having like this very close like family unit and dealing with the awkwardness and you know dealing with relationships and how complicated they can be and then getting caught up with Michael Imperioli who I think is a fantastic supporting character in this series as Minister Payne, who seems to be always getting into some shenanigans with Julio and getting them in trouble. And this series deals with some extreme, weird, out-of-the-ordinary kinds of interactions and different kinds of scenarios where they're doing some weird stuff. And, you know, they get caught up in these crazy things and, you know, it's the kind of thing where it's outlandish, it's ridiculous, but it's grounded because everybody feels so fully realized and genuine in their performances that you're like, maybe this could happen in a strange, warped kind of way, and it just kind of works out that way, and I think Estrada does a fantastic job with the writing and the back end of the show, but also leading and anchoring this series. I think he has a lot of charisma. He's a funny guy. He's able to bring something to the forefront. It leans into a lot of things that we're familiar with. You know, it is a comedy. It's kind of a sitcom and just, you know, a little bit more out there. And this is a kind of series that is very fruitful and you can find so many outlandish ways to shake up the misadventures of Julio and his pals and I look forward to that so bring on season two I want some more but those are my thoughts on this full season one let me know what you think and let's talk some TV but thank you as always for tuning in supporting your Wasteland Reviewer